Uh, hey YouTube, I'm going to teach you how to make a game on PowerPoint today. Um, so obviously first you're going to start off by going to PowerPoint, opening that up. I already got it open, so. Uh, then the first thing you want to do is go to Slide Layouts. Um, this is this might be different on depending on which version you have, um, but you want to change it to a blank. Um, and then exit out of that. And then uh, the next thing you're going to want to do is probably change the background to make it look a little bit, a little different. Uh, there's different ways you can change the background, but I, this is what I do, just a quick and easy way. And just take the square shape and take it over the whole, the whole page. There you go, now you got a blue background. Now this is just the basic game. You're not going to have to do anything crazy, just how to make a basic game, and then you're going to want to, then you're going to want to um, make a new slide and uh, so that you can have different different things going um, so you can have like a menu and everything uh, so then we're just going to go up here to new slide um, make about at least four to get yourself started and then do the same shape with the square to all of them so that they all look the same so there we go there's slide two Go do this on slide three. Just real quick, real easy. And then this will be the base for your game. Um, this game is just an average game. Um, there's you can get creative and, and once you figure out how to use all the tools, you can do different things. So the first thing we're going to do is make a text box, say uh, this is greatest game ever, there you go, there's the title. You can if you can do editing to it if you want to make it bigger, smaller, change the color, do whatever you want to it, just go to the, just go to the little boxes. Um, but for time's sake, we're just not going to do that. So, and then uh, to make different menus, you're going to go make another square, like like so. And then what I do is I double click on it to change the color so it looks different than everything else. Or you just go to fill, and it would just fill it with a different color. And then so I fill it with red so you can see it real good. There you go. Press OK. And then make a text box over that and put something like start game there you go and now after this um, it's a real crucial part that not everybody knows how to do but you want to highlight start game and on a Mac for 2010 version uh, you're going to go to hyperlink on the side um, I don't exactly know how to do it on the other versions, but this is just for Mac. Um, and then you can either do it uh, by clicking on Start Game or by just moving the mouse over it and it will work. But uh, So then we're going to do mouse click and we're going to go to next slide so that when you click on it, it will go to slide 2. And let's see to make sure that it works. Oh, you gotta go into presentation and we'll click on it. There we go, there's slide two. Obviously you can't tell, but just went to the next slide. And uh so the reason we did this, but you're but before that you're also gonna wanna do the box too so you don't have to just click on the words. So do the same thing on mouse click, go to next slide. Just slide two. There we go. And so to start the game, that means we're going to have to make the game on slide two. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a another hyperlink just by clicking the background. This is why we put the shapes as the background so we can um, make a hyperlink. And what we'll do this time, be creative, <laughs> is uh, we'll go to, we're going to make it so that if the mouse goes over over the blue that it will go to a screen that says you lose or slide three 
and so this is another way to do it so you can pick any slides you want besides just saying next slide and so we'll go to slide three that's what we want because we're on slide two right now and so then anytime mouse goes over it and you'll see in a, in a second why we want it to do this so then we'll make shapes we'll go let's do a square and we want to make sure it lines up with this box so that you don't lose right away so then try to line up as good as you can so we'll make it about there it's a little big but it's just the basic game and then we want to change it to red so you can see it and now what we will do is we will make a little pathway and get another rectangle do something just for right now do something simple and change the color to red there we go and then what you can also do is since it's highlighted you can go to edit copy edit paste there you go you got two of them so it makes it oh now it's two times as cool there we go and uh, then you can do something like paste it again and let's just say that if you get to this point you win so we'll put what we'll do is we'll go back and use our hyperlinks but this time we're gonna make once you mouse over this box that you go to slide four which is the winning so we're gonna go on on mouse over uh, off to the side here and we're gonna go to slide and then pick our slide which is slide four there we go so now that goes to slide four and then we can also make it twice as cool not really but uh, winner yay so then uh, and then just to make sure we can also hyperlink this one too on mouse over to make sure it doesn't mouse over slide four there we go and then now we got to set up our winning and losing slides so we said slide three would be the losing slide and so we'll go to text box and just put something like you lose Oop. you lose there we go and then if you want to we really don't have to but there we go make it even worse 92 times bigger so you lose and then four is our winning box so we'll go to something like that you win and there we go so now if you want to play the game um, what you can also do is is just like we made just like we made this box for the start menu you can also make another box for like game rules or prizes or or options and it'll just and then all you have to do is just hyperlink it to a certain slide and then type whatever goes with that slide and that's how you make that but for right now we'll just make a simple game just to show you how to do it and so here's our game just click on it start game so we go from this box and let me just show you if you lose it goes to you lose so then we end it so then we want to start our game again so we start our game now if we win see once we go over it will show that you won here we go you win yeah I know it's the coolest game ever but just to teach you the basics and then use your creativity make it make it a whole lot better than this hopefully your game is a whole lot better than this but yeah rate comment subscribe um, thanks for watching